United Nations statistics place Nigerians' housing deficit at over 22 million homes. Why the National Housing Policy stated that to achieve the goal of providing 15 million housing units by the year 2022, over 1.2 million housing units must be built annually. Noting that in the next 10 years, the number could double if proactive measures are not taken. To this end, stakeholders in the real estate subsector of the economy have called on government at all levels to formulate deliberate policies or revisit existing policies to make land and finances available to mitigate the challenge. The chief executive of an estate development company, Ozo Onukubiri, at the celebration of her company's 10-year anniversary in the estate industry, attributed the problems of housing shortage to physical deterioration, poverty, inadequacy, and inequality in service delivery system that has escalated. Incidents and growth of this problem seem to outpace the capacity of the government to take them on. Nigerians are faced with the fact that these cities are in trouble and that that, is, that that there is an urgent need to do something that will ameliorate the emerging problems. Housing is the second most essential basic needs of mankind outside food. Its impact on the health, welfare, and output of man is profound. Therefore, housing plays a vital role in a person's standard of living and place in the society. Nigeria has a huge housing deficit. The demand for affordable homes far outstrips the supply. She also appealed to the relevant authorities to intensify efforts in meeting the housing needs of the Nigerian middle and lower class citizens. The economic situation is not, not necessarily aiding us to, do, to deliver this. However, it is still in the pipeline, it's still part of what we want to do in the coming 10 years. The financial situation is, is quite undulated, it's all over the place. And this has greatly affected us. Uh, it, it has um, affected our projections. Uh, it's nothing that can be repaired immediately, but I know that the government is working on it. Some stakeholders also shared their thoughts on how to tackle the nation's huge housing gap. It is our prayer that as housing, mortgaging, and everything that has to do with affordable housing delivery emerges in Nigeria, your support, contribution is highly required. Distance is dead. What it simply means is that the world is now in my palms. The world is closer to each other than you can ever imagine. The consequences of this reality, the reality of globalization, is that, that our competition is no longer local. It is estimated that about 100,000 housing units are built annually and an average of 80% of Nigerians live in informal housing plagued by problems related to poor quality and inadequate infrastructure which affect their standard of living and place in the society. Ugochi Obaja, CNA News.